Hello everybody, this is a Rush demo and in no way represents the final product's quality. This is Paper Bugs. It's a game I follow on Tumblr. I wanted to check it out and show it all to you guys today. So let's check out Paper Bugs. I'm going to start up a new game and let's go. I actually haven't played past the first little tiny, tiny, tiny bit. Welcome, Noble Bugs. New here? Press A to advance text. Welcome to this world that we call Bulgaria. For now. A great expanse of green ruled by the almighty Ant Queen, bordering the Bee and Termite Kingdoms as well as the wild lands beyond. Unfortunately, only a small area is accessible right now. The way, the one we are located, and two others. If you require assistance on controls or pointers on what to do, just walk near me and press A. I'll be more than delighted to give you assistance. I believe I do not need to remind you how to move, but you can use up, down, left, and right to do so. Just in case you want to open the pause menu where you can see and use items and change settings, press select. On behalf of those who organized this game, I wish for you to have fun exploring and doing the small tasks we placed around, as they said. I apologize in their name that this is the old version since the new one is still bare bones. They also wanted me to tell you that Beelies and Moths field skills are disabled, but they can regain those by doing errands for some bugs around here. That being said, have some fun in this area, and don't hesitate to ask me if you need anything. So this is a um, demo of the game. This is what it looks like when you run around. Um, don't worry about all the bugs. I see at least, what, six, seven bugs on the screen right now? Um, not a big deal. Eight, nine, there's a lot, ten, there's lots of bugs. Um, but bugs will get fixed. Ooh, I like that. That's very, very Paper Mario-y. Welcome to the test shop. Just like my job, this area exists in a place that doesn't exist. Do you need anything? So you have like, I want to buy, I want to sell. So let's say I want to buy something. Everything I have here is over there. Uh, stand in front of it and press A or whatever. You need money? Get some from cutting grass or beating enemies. I don't know. Just bring me it. So, you know, rainbow drop, 18 berries, a, um, a clear drop that reflects light, um, cures all status effects. A mysterious drink that fills you with energy can bring a falling alley, fallen ally back. Four berries, um, drops honey from the bee kingdom for TP, and a leaf that is somewhat withered restores some small, small amounts of HP. Holy cow, I have to use a thumbstick. Um, let's talk to this guy. I'm here only to test saving for now. Would you like to save? Saving, please do not exit application. There, game is saved. All right, so the game is saved. Let's talk to this guy. Howdy, have you heard of our special land storage offer for the month? For a limited time, we're letting you sign up for a junior account. You'd be able to store and withdraw 35 items for free. For free! No more tears over having to skip that crunchy leaf. There's no way you wouldn't want this deal, so I'll sign you up right now. Hey. It's okay, B. The services will most, are mostly advantageous. Grr. Don't you know nothing's ever free? I don't trust her. Mm. And that's done. Just talk to me whenever you want to use our services. Thank you very much. <laughs> So, so far, so good. I'm liking all this test stuff. Having trouble crossing? Lazy party members? Try using the field actions to get through. Press Y. Okay, so that's my attack. I can throw a thing. So, okay, so I hit something and the bridge opened up for us. So that's kind of cool. Um, let's talk to this guy. Oh, that's an enemy. So it looks like we have combat. Oh my goodness. So we have inventory. We have... Strategies, we have try attack, we have attack. So let's do the um, regular attack. Press A when the icon lights up. Oh, I like this a lot. This is exactly what I'm looking for. I did not read what to do there. So press the button at the end of the countdown. So it looks like I got that one. I think I can block, maybe? Okay, I'm able to block just like in Paper Mario. But we all got hit for quite a bit of damage, so I'm going to try this again. And I keep failing. But I killed the guy, so that means that's pretty cool. We can move on to the next guy. Um, I don't know if I did something wrong, but there doesn't seem to be any music. So, I don't know if that's something on my end that I did wrong, or whatever. But it seems to be very, very much like Paper Mario. So we're going to go and we're going to do a... Um, I want to try to just do a regular attack again. And I keep failing the attacks, which is going to... It says hold left. So that's much like the um, hammer in the Paper Mario games. And it told me to press a different button, and I wasn't expecting such a thing. 
And I think he might be just close to dead. Okay, so it looks like I'm getting the hang of this combat system, and... Look at that. Just like good old Paper Mario. You got Crunchy Leaf. Now, I don't know if there's supposed to be music. I don't hear anything. I don't know if that's a bug. I mean, I hear people when they talk to me, so I know the sound's working. See? Well, well. Are you ready for the chow of your life? Bring me ingredients and I'll make you some chow. Chop, chop. Come on, let's get messy. How do you want your chow today? I want to cook with one ingredient. Show me what you got. Crunchy leaf. So crunchy leaf, you sure? No refunds. Give me my chow. Watch a master do its work. So I'm actually really liking the aesthetic of this game so far. I'm actually liking pretty much everything that's going on. And I'm super hyped for when the game is done. Here it is, a masterwork. Eat up, small fry. And if they're remaking it to make it even better, I'm even more excited because this is actually what I've been wanting for a long time. Come back later when your stomach grows hungry again. Now, I don't know if, like, my health is... Like, if it goes back. I have 1878. Eight. So, I'm pretty low on, like, everything. And I don't know if saving... Saving does not restore health. So let's talk to some people. I'm full... I've fully healed... Yay! I'm fully healed now. What do, what do you do? Oh, wait, you're my friend. Okay, so this is the party. They all walk around with you, which is pretty cool. Let's save the game again, because you know how it goes. You can jump, you can you can use an ability. I actually, my controller is a little bit broken, and this game doesn't have a dead zone, so whenever I let go, I just start walking left. It's not the game, it's me. Man, there's a lot of tool, tall bushes around here. I've heard there's a pair of siblings with something to help, but they're on the other side of the river to the right. I saw somebody, I saw nobody suspicious come through here, so that's the only place they might be. So I can switch characters, and they can all do different things. Um, let's see, or, or I thought they could. I don't know what this guy does, but nothing, nothing interesting. I think he's the only one. I'm using the D-pad now to move. So we're gonna walk around, and we're gonna check. Can I break bushes with my boomerang? Doesn't look like it. Um, so we're just gonna keep going. What is this guy? Is he a bad guy? Huh. Nope, doesn't look like a bad guy. Hey, you look like smart bugs. Some of us are. Hey, well, at least smart enough to know the value of this. What? It can't be. What is it? Gold? An artifact? It's a limited edition Bug Ranger Green. Guess he wasn't the smart one. <sighs> Steamed merchant. Name your price. Why, well, I think 40 berries should do it. Okay, goodbye. Beetle, if you spent our savings on this, I'll never forgive you. Gah, I would never. I shall save up the money myself. Hey, I'll be waiting. Okay, so I don't know if I'm supposed to do that. But I have not. So I'm going to keep walking this way. I'm going to check out what's going on over here. Grumble. I wish I had some music. Wait, you two. This bug seems to be troubled. Oh, please. Beetle, do you plan to stop to talk to every single bug on the road? It's my duty as a fellow bug, should they be troubled. Come on, Beetle. It's going to be night time. I won't abandon him. Look how sad he is. I can hear everything, you know. I am sad, though. So, it's pretty cool. It's no use, Bee. Without a sharp blade, we can't cut the grass ahead. Ugh. This is why I hate teamwork. Fine, let's hear him out. Uh, thanks, I guess? I'm just really hungry. A mushroom from the Snake Mouth Cave would be nice, but I'm too old to fight the monsters inside. Why, we were just going there. We'll bring you one. What do we get out of it? I've seen some things in my ears. I do possess a magic item that could teach the, your moth friend something quite useful, with the magic I sense coming from within. Is that so? Why can't they offer money? We'll see to it. See you soon. Be careful now. Okay, so, like the game said, I have to unlock the other two's abilities. Um, they're disabled by default, and we have to unlock their powers. So that's kind of cool. So let's go on a journey to unlock the powers. I'm really liking this game. I like how it feels. I like the aesthetic. I don't know what this guy is. Who are you? What do you want? Oh, wait, I already talked to this guy. So we're going to go this way. And since we did a cutscene, I might as well save, because it will save us any time if I die. I'm having to do that stuff over again, because why would I want to do something over again? So we're going to go this way, and we're going to check out what's in the area to the right over here. Let's look around a little bit. I might have to do this as um, a two-part series, because I don't longer than I was actually expecting it to be. I said I can't. Please, just one honey drop. What a noisy pair. Yeah, whatever happened to keeping the dysfunctional at home? 
Now you two, let me handle this. Excuse us, may we help you? Yeah, you can convince my sister to stop being so stingy. Brother, don't mind him. He fails to realize the situation we're in. So do we. What would that be? Our parents. They have gone missing. It's been weeks now. I told you they're just exploring. I, I don't know if they'll return, and what I'm gonna do to make ends meet. You po you're poor, basically. B. Yes, it's true. Even a simple honey drop is a luxury we can't afford. It's just a few berries. What an ungrateful sibling you have. If you could, would you give him a honey drop? Although money I can't give you, surely I can give you something of value. Deal. B. We couldn't possibly take from them. Hey, I ain't a charity, and they offered. Sir Beetle, don't worry. We're not looking for pity. Very well, we'll do what we can. So it seems like Beetle's the knightly one. Then they get the smart wizard guy, and then there's B, who's just kind of like the protagonist. Um, I don't think I can get back there, because of all the fences, but so far, man, I am impressed. Like, I don't know if you guys see it the way I do, but holy cow, I'm like watching this game and I'm like, man. So they want a berry, but I can't cut any bushes because I don't have, oh geez. Hang on, I need to look around a little bit more, because I can't get to B's house, I don't think without being able to cut without being able to cut the things and I can't go this way so let's talk to them again did he manage to find the honey drop um no um I can't really um help these people out because I do not know where I'd find a honey drop besides when I fall off the edge like 12 times because I have no depth perception I think I just have to keep fighting people over and over again, but let's try doing, um, I'm gonna do an attack, and we're gonna hold left until the icon lights up. So there, we got that down, and he's pressing the button, and I got that extra damage. This guy's actually pretty strong. Press A when the icon lights up. And that was bad, but I did finish him off, so... I think it tells you which person is getting attacked, so that's also a handy thing. But overall, it's a pretty simple combat system. I like it. It's, um, kind of what I'd want to do. Um, I pressed the wrong button there. Um, bam. Man, I, I can't get the timing right for this. It's a little bit different than what I'm used to. Um, we're going to take him on. And he will be destroyed by me. Hopefully I drop a honey drop or something. So press the button that's shown at the end of the countdown. I got it that time. He should be destroyed. We might have gotten the money we need. Crunchy leaf. They wanted a honey drop, right? So I can go in here and I can look around. This is a honey drop. I do have enough berries, so I'll take it. And then the people over there will be happy because I can give them what they ask for. I'm gonna heal up and I'm gonna save. And then we're gonna go and give them the berries that they asked for. So yeah, paper bug. You can check them out on Tumblr. Paper bug dev, I think it was. So it's something like that. Um, it's in the beginning of the video. I'll put a link to it in the description. You can check that out. Give them some support. You know, just maybe just follow them and keep an eye on it and decide what you want later. I mean, you don't have to take my word, but it's going to be like this, but better. So, it's good enough for me. Did you manage to find a honey drop? There you go. Yay, it's been so long since I ate one. Forgive his rudeness. He doesn't want to show it, but he does miss our parents. Our mother would bring honey drops every week and we'd eat them together. I pray they are safe. Now, you were speaking of something valuable? Classy. Oh, of course! Sir Beetle, I do have an item that could allow you to utilize an effective technique to cut bushes with your horn. Why do you have that? That would be most helpful. I'm, I'm starting to learn voices here. What a waste of time. That's not valuable at all. Doesn't seem resellable either. All right, here it is. Point Needle. This is amazing. Well, at least he's happy. Yay. To use this, tap Y while Sir Beetle is le leading the party. It will cut most bushes and push objects out of your way. I'm sure it will prove most very useful. Thank you, I truly mean it. So now when I'm playing as him, I should... I throw that as him. Yeah, I can actually like cut bushes open and stuff. And push things out of my way, so... 
It's looking pretty cool. I've got the ability to cut grass. So, my money making is at an all time high. Um, it doesn't look like I can get to Bug's house. Oh, there's a tunnel. Where does it go? Who are you? What is this guy? Hello, I am called Mare. I am a, the programmer, modeler, artist, and animator of this game. Good job coming here. Sure, the demo is bare bones, but we want the final game to be much better than this. More battle options, better graphics, more features, etc. We will do it eventually. Have this extra 10 BP to celebrate you coming here. Well, cool. You got HP+, plus. you got TP+, plus. you got HP+, plus. so I'm getting a whole bunch of really cool items. Who are you? Hey, Jin here. I've been writing all the dialogue for this game and coming up with a story and character designs. Hopefully you like it. I'm so glad you found us. I was worried no one would find this area. If you've spoken to us, you've definitely seen everything in this secret area. So, pretty much overall, um, there's some secrets to be had. And I fell down from the sky, but that's pretty cool. Went straight up from there. So, let's save the game again. And I found a secret area all on my own. That's pretty cool. I just was like, hey, this rock. Like, I just wanted to try to see if I could move the rock. It was really just like the first thing I thought of. This rock's too big, so obviously I can't push this. Um, now that guy over there, he wanted something from the cave. Can I move this? Nope. Can I push this? I don't know what I can do, so I'm kind of trying everything. I don't want to do a um, disservice to the game by not trying everything. This looks kind of suspicious. Wow, what a pretty Sophie. A Sophie's perpetual, for it has for it to still be so beautiful after falling off of its branch. It holds true to its name. That's weird. I don't see any other Sophies around here. Hmm. Even truer to its name, this flower may be immune to withering effects. How long has it been here, I wonder? I don't know. You probably could ask the botanists back in the kingdom. Indeed. We should report this later. Although, B, I thought for sure you'd be... <clears throat> Although, B... I thought for sure you'd feel like pollinating such a nice flower. Eh, there's no point. I'm not working for a hive right now. Is that so? You'll have to tell me more later. But for now, let's keep moving. Mm hmm Let's go before the sun sets. Or even worse, before it rains. Alright, so I think I can... I can just jump over this. I don't know what I was thinking. But overall, I'm gonna have to cut the grass to get through here, but we're gonna... Switch back to beetle so I can break the grass around this area. So that's pretty cool. Grass, grass, grass. I'm not actually sure how long this demo is and I don't want to just stop it and have a really short video next time. So I'm just gonna keep playing and if it's reasonable, then I'm going to make it just one long fun video called Let's Check Out Paper Bug or Etza, Etza Checks Out Paper Bug or whatever. Doesn't matter what I call it. As long as I call it something, and people are able to watch it. So we can cut down these um, big branches, like these bush things. And I think that's in my best interest to break all of them. I do have a cat about ready to jump on my lap. So I might, there might be a loud sound. It's happening right now. Oh, there it goes. All right, so now we're in a mysteriously dark cave. And so far, if this is the old demo, all right, let's uh, bang. Oh, you can't jump on them. It's not Mario. Can't jump on enemies. What I want to do is I want to try a try attack to see what that does. So we're gonna strategies try attack. Come on. It's not the game's fault. That's my fault. My controller is broken. I can't do a try attack. So that works. You can also hit right. Um, press the button shown at the end of the countdown. Okay, so I'm, I'm getting this. I'm figuring it out. Then this one just press A when it lights up. So I think the timing is becoming my friend. So let's... Okay, so you don't actually have to hold left the whole time. Because I just tapped left because I didn't have my hand on the controller the right way. We got a mushroom. Didn't that guy want a mushroom? He wanted something from this cave. can't quite remember what it is. And I just fell. Um, can I... I think this guy's gonna give us the ability to fly or something, maybe? I'm gonna try to switch characters here. Nope. I don't know if that's what his ability is, but I need to fix the controller. Was there something over there? I can't really tell. 
I think the guy wanted a mushroom, though, so I'm going to go back out and talk to the guy. So it's very possible. That's all he needed was a, was a friendly, friendly mushroom. So let's break this open. And let's see what that guy is doing. Hello, old man. Where are you? I know you're over here somewhere. There you are. Okay, fellas, did you find the mushroom? Yes, we did. Oh, this is it, the mushroom. Thank you, folks. Jump, jump. It was our play. Yerk. Huh? What happened? This room, it can't be eaten like this. What a tragedy. Oh, well, too bad. Now for that reward. Hmm. We may be able to get it cooked. I know a fly chef in town. There is altruism, and then there's you. This is dumb. Oh, thank you. I'll make the reward worth it. Fine, let's go. So now we have to take the mushroom back to town. And I'm assuming that guy who does the cooking in the town, he will take the mushroom and cook it for us. So, so far so good. Hello guy, I need you to cook the mushroom. Well, well, are you ready for the chow of your life? Bring me ingredients. I want to cook with one ingredient and I want to cook the mushroom. You sure? Yep. Did he actually charge me money for it? Um, I don't know for sure. I can't see over the cat in front of my television. I set the cat down. Here it is, a masterwork. Eat up, small fry. You got to cook mushroom. Come back later when your stomach growls again. So we can take this back to the old man and hopefully his stomach will be satisfied and he will be ready for niblets. So hello, old man. So is it ready? And then we're gonna do um, cooked mushroom. Snarl, snack, chomp. This is delicious. It was our pleasure. Yay, reward time. We are curious about the magic. Come, moth. The mysterious item will allow you to summon ice to fall from the sky. With it, you can freeze many things, even water. Well, except for fast currents. Eh, uh, well, here it is. You got magic ice. What? No, I want it. No, can do. Only moths can pull this off. Only moth can use battle skills, too. Oh no, what a tragedy, eh, B? Mm. Okay, now, since we have the ice power, I actually want to go back and save. Um, might be a good idea, because if we don't save, we could die. And if we die, we might lose everything that we worked so hard for up to this point. But we have all the abilities now, I believe. We have, we have Moth's ability, we have Beetle's ability, and we have Bee's ability. The hardest one to get so far has been Bee's ability. I'm, I'm just kidding. That was the one we started with. Um, I wonder if, is anyone faster than the other one? I guess they wouldn't want to do that because then you really wouldn't have any reason to use the other characters except for the fast one in the overworld for the most part. So I guess I understand. It helps if I push the right buttons. So now we can get across the water current because we have, we have good old magic man here. So I don't want to fight. Ah, I wasn't, I wasn't prepared for that. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to do ice fall and we're going to create an ice projectile all enemies so I hit a couple of the people so that's pretty cool um, I can't do a try attack so I'm going to attack and hopefully finish this guy to his death and the other two should be pretty easy to defeat I didn't actually successfully block there. I don't know why I didn't, um, why I didn't, what am I trying to say? I didn't heal myself while I was in the area, but, you know, I should have, but I didn't, so, oh well. There we go. So that guy's defeated. We got another mushroom, that's pretty cool. And hopefully that doesn't hurt us. I'm trying to freeze the water. It's not working. Wait, I can't freeze this water. So how do I get across the ravine here? Don't want to fight, don't want to fight that guy. Um, if I can't cross the water there, there must be water somewhere else that I can cross. So I'm going to take a peek. If I can't figure that out, this might be a good, a good stopping point. Um, what does this do? Speed up. Um, let me go to my items here. Perks and status. I never even equipped these things. HP up, TP up, speed up. It looks like I can't have all of them. No, I can. I actually have enough BP for everything. 
Okay, makes sense. Red must be everybody. Okay, so he has 14. Settings, resolution... See, there should be music. There's no music. Um, I don't know if I did something wrong. Or if it... Hold on. Sorry about that. I don't know if I did that wrong or what. I might try to superimpose the music at the end. It won't be the official way of doing things. Library. Inventory. Alright. So, I had a bunch of badges. I never used them. I'm moving a bit faster, though, which is going to come in handy. I don't have enough money for this at this point. I might do a little bit more later, but I don't see too much of a reason to do that. So we're getting pretty close to the end. Um, I just want to take a quick look around and see if there's any water that I should be freezing or anything like that. Um, sorry, the music doesn't seem to be working correctly. Um, can I run away? Because I'd, I'd love to run if I can. Actually, I think I'm having a lot of controller issues right now. So, yeah, once this match is over here, I'm probably just gonna... Wow, what was that? Why did it say two? Press one. So, weird things are suddenly happening. Um, I think I might have enough, um, have enough magic that I can use um, someone else's move in a second. So we're going to try to use one of his abilities here. So here it goes. That should have killed both of them, hopefully. There's one left, but I think he'll die pretty much no matter what I do. So he's done, and he's dead. All right, everybody. Thanks so much for watching this video on Paper Bug. Let's see. Hang on a second. I got to check something real quick. Can I, can I do this? My I think I broke my controller today. Alright, whatever. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode of whatever I do. Or whatever I do next. Thanks for watching. See you guys. Leave a comment and a rating. Check out Paperbug on Tumblr. See you next time.